I first started training at Glendale Fighting Club at 10 years old. I was a fat kid, fat chubby kid, you know, just wanting to go to lose weight and just started competing in karate and grappling and everything and just like fell in love with it. Shadow boxing taught us all about the children who are in the hands for Hoskirinak. And as my Jamanak, Hoskirinak, no rope, 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 no rope. Coach Edmund, we go back already from 10 years old. I've known him. Both of us are Armenians. He's like an older brother to me, you know. I basically grew up with him. I've been teaching for 22 years, and, you know, we've had champions from our gym. Ron Rousey was a special champion. It was so cool watching Ronda growing up. I would I would spar with her and stuff like that. This kid has been here from 10 years old. For Edmund to look at her, how she trained, how she prepared to be a champion, how she worked with the UFC, she was, he was part of the open workouts with her. Her guidance to Edmund has been tremendous. To see how quickly she rose to fame definitely motivated me to be in that position soon. And I'm happy to be right now represented by her and work my way towards being an amazing champion like her as well. Play some Fortnite. That's the game. <laughs> a lot of little kids are real good at the game. But then you have the beast adults that just give them a little touch of humanity. Oh. It's funny enough, my daughters actually got me hooked on the game. I wasn't playing the game until, like, they started playing. And I played it like one time and then I was hooked on it. It's like really challenging. There's nothing in this world that I love more than my kids and my family, you know? Coming down to South Florida is hard, you know, being away from the family, but ultimately the main goal is to come down here, get in really good shape, go to the fight, put on a very good fight, and come back to the family and be better for my whole family. The last two camps I've been doing down here, I come out for two weeks, then I go home for like a couple of days, and then I come back and finish out two weeks, then go to a fight. But with this COVID stuff and the flights are all jacked up, I just, you know, came straight out here and just, you know, suck it up and just do the four weeks and then go to the fight and then go home. What's up? What's up, man? You playing a shark game? Yeah. Oh, is it fun or what? Yeah. Just chilling out. Playing some, playing some games. Can you tell me how many sharks I have? Yeah, how many have? Nine sharks. Dang. In the shark game? Yep. This game is tough. This game's pretty hard. Did you just download it? Yeah, I download. I'm playing it right now. I love my kids dearly, you know, and that's one of the things that you can't get back in life. You can get everything back, money, um, belts, but, you know, you can't get time back. I'm going to call you back in a little bit, OK? Okay. All right, I love you. Love you all right, see you later. It's definitely tough, but it makes it all worthwhile, you know, especially, you know, after the fight to go out there and get a big win, you know, it feels all, you know, justified and fulfilling, you know. You can go back home and spend that quality time.